Okay, so we're trying to do some metal etching and uh, we've been printing up some, some logos that you can iron on to metal. We tried to iron on some, but we're using aluminum. What we found out is, is it works on steel. So it's, it's kind of a reverse of electrolysis. So we're using a car battery charger. We're putting the positive on the piece that we want etched. So it's becoming our anode, and then we're just using a little Q-tip on the negative side and a little bit of salt water. And it's, it's actually pretty cool. Check this out, man. So you just dip the, the Q-tip in salt water, and uh, if you had ink, if you had ink on it, um, it would... Uh, so you can see it's starting to smoke, eh? Uh, it's actually eating the metal and transferring it onto the Q-tip, which I can't believe how fast it's working. Anyway, we'll, we'll give you a... Uh, watch what happens when he refreshes it. That's just table salt and water. And it just is eating the metal. So if we get the artwork transferred onto the steel, it'll only eat the areas uh, not seen. And of course, we're we're trying to do a familiar logo. Thank you.